The wildebeest is an interesting animal. Known as the cow of the Serengeti, it's a bit ungainly, but it does look something like a small cow, and it lives in Africa in a very wild part of the world. Now, what's interesting about the wildebeest is that it runs very, very quickly. Very, very quickly. As a matter of fact, it runs so quickly that, in fact, the lions, the hyenas, and etc. that love to feast on it often have a difficult time catching it. But here's the interesting point. When the mother gives birth to the baby wildebeest, within 10 minutes, the wildebeest is up on its feet, running full speed with the flock. Because if, in fact, the wildebeest baby were to dawdle, were to have some trouble, the hyenas or the lions would eat it. But within 10 minutes of birth, the baby wildebeest is running full speed with the adults. But here's the most amazing part. There are different gates that animals would run with. Some animals run front to paws, then back to paws, front to paws, back to paws. Some animals run left, front, and back, right, then left, rear, and right, front. They run in a very coordinated manner. The wildebeest has one of the most sophisticated gates of any animal running. And when scientists film it and they see the timing of the feet movement, it's down to the microsecond. Meaning to say, when that baby's born, not only does he have the full maturity physically in terms of the skeletal system and the muscles needed, the coordination is so precise that when in 10 minutes after birth, he's running full gait with the full speed of an adult wildebeest. Think of a human baby who at 10 months takes his or her first step, and after the first step, the third step falls down, and mommy goes, yay, wonderful. That's not the wildebeest running full speed almost from birth because that's what's necessary for its survival. And when you study some of the features that God put into the world, gave to the animal kingdom, you see the capacity of our creator, you see his wisdom, you have an eye glimpse to see the greatness of our creator.